Teresa Freed with Johnson County Government. It's our goal to stop the spread of COVID-19 in our community. We also want to make sure you have the latest information on our efforts. For data on how COVID-19 is impacting the county, visit our dashboard on jocogov.org. Dr. Sami Areola, Director for the Department of Health and Environment. So there's a lot of uh, recommendations that we have given to the public that are very important to uh, controlling the spread of the virus and protecting you and I from uh, uh, infection from, uh, from COVID-19. Uh, one of those is not wearing gloves. Wearing gloves might be useful in certain settings. In most settings, it is not, and that's why we don't recommend that. When you wear gloves, you are unlikely to, to wash your hands as frequently as you need to. You are likely to use hand sanitizers. And actually, the sight of uh, look, seeing people in grocery stores and other places wear, uh, wearing gloves, uh, uh, for us that are uh, working in this field, it's really scary because then you, are, you might be contributing to the spread of the virus or the germs. As you touch one surface and you touch another and you move on, your hands might be protected, but you might be spreading those things uh, 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 to, to other places and to other people. So our recommendation is for you to avoid using gloves. It's good for people in medical settings and people in very, very, uh, in, uh, in some restricted, uh, uh, some few businesses, most people, we do not recommend uh, gloves. It might be contributing more to the problem than being part of the solution. I do want uh, people to know that still the primary mode of transmission is uh, respiratory. So what we're asking people is to protect their face, really what we call the T-zone, which is the eyes, the nose, and the mouth. And that's why we are saying wear mask. That's why we're saying uh, wash your hands uh, and uh, uh, avoid touching your face. Now it is possible for the virus to survive on surfaces for a long period of time. And so out of an abundance of caution, you wash your hands and when you can't, you use hand sanitizers. But the significant uh, mode of transmission is still respiratory. That's why we are strongly encouraging you to wear masks. For more information about COVID-19 in Johnson County, visit jococov.org forward slash coronavirus. You can also subscribe to a daily e-newsletter with the latest data and precautions being taken in the county and state.